I don't even sell shirts. I sell body butters. It's just like it'd be too many people for her. She'll get you doing just body butters. Mm-hmm. Why you ain't giving me no body butter to promote for you? Oh, uh, because I I sell them. I have a body. It likes butter. No, you like butter. Exactly. So why you ain't giving me none of your body butters to try? <laughs> You gonna just leave it alone, CP? It was too easy. You just you I'm wanted. Just, I'm gonna walk away because y'all y'all was having like your body likes butter, and this butter is just like you know what? I, I, it does. I, I got my own thing going on. I'm gonna watch <laughs> what I got going on. Y'all, let me know when we live. You know what? what are you? We are like. What is your? What are you watching? Oh, nothing. <laughs> I just I just turned on my monitor because I need some light, and uh, so. Just got it going on me. It looks like a rave. It's all this light going on and off. Yeah. No, it's just uh it's just the intro to mad. Put your porno on pause right there so the light don't keep uh, flickering. See, now you say that. See, <laughs> now I gotta it's not a porno. See. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Swish it right quick with your mouse. We know how it go. Whatever. Man. Right quick with the First of all, don't porn shame nobody, man. Crazy. If he was <laughs> watching porn, that means he has a healthy sex life. Okay. He's just that's incredible. not actually that's not what that means at all. You don't there's know a lot of means. weirdos who just watch porn because they don't have sex. Well, he's married with two kids, so he's obviously fucking a little bit. Okay, I'm not porn shaming right anyone. Now. I was saying right put now. it on pause. It feels like right you're porn shaming him, man. And that's not that's if I not said put it on pause because the light was all flickering on his face, that was the key hey. point of what I was trying to say. That lets me know you don't be watching porn because porn the light ain't flickering like that. Uh, it was uh, flick on him. I the, said, kind of porn, porn, the kind of porn that men would watch has all the genitalia blurred out. That's what they like over in Japan. They like that. They like that blurred out shit. You'd be like, oh, okay. Oh, well. so that it, is it, hilarious. Using my imagination. With blurred out. <laughs> <laughs> what would that even be called? Your porn? Mm-mm. Porn is funny to me, but acting is, especially the ones with the acting. Yeah, that's, that's, that's why I don't watch that. I watch all real porn. Oh. I don't, I like, I like the one that, the one like that people make at home. Amateur, yeah, yeah. I like I, I like watching what they got on their TV. I've done that. I've definitely seen some. Like, oh, they watch the Family Guy. They cool as hell. Watching uh, Law and mm-hmm. Order. Definitely seen Law and Order on a couple screens. What did I walk into? What's up, Lil? <laughs> what up, y'all? Chilling. Chillin'. All have walked into the conversation at horrible moments, and then just so when I walk in. So here was saying how he's selling body butters, and Meg was like, "I have a body; it likes butter." And then, <laughs> right? And then to here was like, "No, you like butter." And I'm just right here like, "Why did I walk into this big roastable situation?" And I'm just gonna step out of it, right? So then I turned on my gaming monitor to give me some light, and it was the intro to Madden playing. So then Meg goes. Pause your porn because, and I'm like, so then I turn the screen, show that it was Madden, right? Then we start talking about uh, amateur porn. He, he didn't like the fact that it appeared that Meg was porn shaming me, even mm-hmm. if I was watching Ooh, porn. Yeah. Was it? And he was yeah. like, that's not cool. That's because she approved. Meg and I said, and then I said, due to uh, Meg's Asian descent, that the type of porn that she watches has all the genitalia blurred out anyway. Yeah, they do be having that one. I, yeah, yeah. That, they do be having like, that. Like, what is Wait, is that real? Is that really true? I thought the, yeah. the Japanese people like to do nasty stuff. No, it's right, but Twitter, yeah, nasty stuff they, they blurred out. out. It's a Twitter page out. I follow yeah. that that does all anime porn. Uh, but they always blur out the genitalia on there too. Like yeah. every video is blurred. I'm like. And you know what? But that's something cool to watch on a Sunday. Well, you like, you know what? I, <laughs> on a Sunday, yeah. it's the Lord's Day, so I'm gonna. Well, you still want to be horny, but you still want to praise the yeah. Lord. Yeah. <laughs> and get my brain some time to work. Let me imagine what's going on. Let me let me that get my brain funny. a little puzzle to solve. <laughs> a little puzzle to solve. Funny. No. 
Nah, I need to see the real thing, man. Don't play with me. Don't play with it. Don't play with it. Don't play with it. Play with it. <laughs> <laughs> what you been up to, Lou? Lou, I miss you. I miss you too, bro. I've been out here traveling the world and, you know, playing golf. And oh, Man, I missed Top Golf last night. Man, we had so much fun, CP. Expat. What, did y'all, what, what was it for? Y'all just met up at Top Golf or y'all had an event? Uh, no, so um, I'm partnered up with Callaway, which is mm-hmm. also partnered up with Top Golf. So my people's at Top Golf was like, "Hey, come on over. If you want to bring your friends on over, have a good time." And I was like, "That's exactly what I wanted to." So I invited all the homies that I know like golf or was interested in golf and was trash in golf, and that way I could give y'all lessons and you know just have a good time. I was one of the 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 pros you hit up, right? Yeah, no, but I- you was one of the hoes she to hit up because you a hoe. <laughs> Damn no, it, you know what? Pat was it actually rhymed pretty... and everything. That was so oh, easy. It Pat. rhymed and everything. That to me. Pat, that was, you was actually pretty good. I was. I, have, I, I got a swing on me, don't I? Yeah, you got a nice little swing. You got to work on your form, and once you do that, you'll be all right. Just keep your head down. That's your biggest thing. Just keep your head. Hey, down. Lou, out here getting to these sponsorships, though. Don't yes, let, I love. Don't it. let the Harry Potter scarf in the back fool you. <laughs> 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 she out here working with Callaway. Hey, hey Lou, um, is Denny Love on the road with y'all too? Yeah, so Denny Love opens, then I feature, then it's Chris. Oh, dope. That's dope. Yeah, he's a young, young gun. But yeah. I like I like his energy. He's confident. Chris he's, who? Chris D'Elia. Okay. Dope. Nice. Oh, dope. He's hilarious. That's what she's been touring. You've been touring with him for like a year and a half, right? Two years? No, we no, I just started in October. Really? I don't know yeah. why I thought you were. Who you were you with someone before, Chris? Nah, I was just out on. I was headlining myself. I was on okay. my own joint. So it, it'll then, be a year in October, though. Yes, this October okay, gotcha. will be a year. Okay. Did and, you do uh, spots with him? I feel like I, I feel like I low key remember you uh, working with him for a minute, right? Or has it really just been since October? Well, that's when I hopped on his tour. But before mm-hmm. that, uh, you know, I'd be hosting at the Laugh Factory. Okay. So when he was working out his new material, he would do like the first show and the second show. Sometimes I would host the first show and the second show. So mm-hmm. that's how like we just became cool. And like, I would really just pick his brain. And like, cause he that's really respects the craft. Like that dude was funny as fuck. And I was just like asking questions. And then one day he just asked his tour manager, was like, hey, you think Lulu was down to come on the road? And the tour manager asked me, he, before he even finished, he's like, hey, Chris want to know. I was like, yep. <laughs> <laughs> I sure do. See. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, yes. Absolutely. So, so that was October. And then I, that was, I've been on since then. So okay. it's, been, it's been so cool, man. It's, it's, I've never thought like performing in front of like 3,000 people. Yeah. Ooh. That that be his theater, Crazy. and it's that's like, like, is that an arena? He theater. did an arena, but they only did half of the arena. They, mm-hmm. they it was like a hockey rink type joint, so mm-hmm. that was like, that was like thirty two hundred or something like that. That's mm-hmm. a grip of people. Man. And then the biggest, <laughs> did, the biggest he did was in Denver. That joint was forty five hundred. There was a jumbotron of Sheesh. me on the back. I was I, I forgot I was on stage. I was like, oh. <laughs> right, like like the kiss cam and shit. Uh, yeah. <laughs> but yeah, oh, yeah. He, he be having people like come through and buy the VIP joint. Mm-hmm. Like they be waiting in line to get a picture with him. They be bringing him gifts. It's, like it's crazy. It is so crazy. He's the like weirdest a, thing. He like a the, young legend. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like it's levels to it. You know, you think of people like Aziz Ansari who were on that level too. And then they ascend to like, you know, just like, it's all about your reach. Mm-hmm. I remember him, he had, he had some of the funniest shit. Then it came out, he was Justin Bieber's favorite comic. Remember that? That was a huge deal. Yeah. And that, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's just, wow, this like this comedy game, you can get inspired by a lot of people. Like, man, like it can happen so many ways. Right. Yeah, I, I never thought he would inspire me because it's like just to see his brain work. It's like when I watch CP, like you got that same mentality, like to see our brains work while you're on stage, like doing like he'll do 
Come on, man. You know what it is. Here's some flowers, man. Here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Like this. Take them and just break them. He gave me some flour, hey, man, not even flour. Take no flour. Here's some flour. flour to fry chicken in. Throw it up like LeBron. Oh, this is that's hilarious. The nigga who didn't understand the phrase. I, I, I'm here to bring you your flour. I'm giving you your flour, man. It's already seasoned, man. This nah, you it. deserve it, man. You deserve your flour. All purpose. <laughs> all purpose flowers. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. I appreciate that, Lulu. Well, no, <laughs> seriously, man, because comedy is hard and people think this shit is easy. So to see mm-hmm. people like who are really dope at it and like still like have a dope reach, like you could reach not just like black people, white people, Asian people who don't speak fucking English. Like we going to Australia in all uh, September. Damn. Mm. Yeah. Dangerous. Right? <laughs> like, what's the Australian language? I feel like they just speak bad English. Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, they don't speak English? They, you no, know I'm saying like they don't know our culture. They don't know, uh, you know what I'm saying? So to connect, to be able to connect with people that don't understand your lifestyle, your culture, and shit like that, mm-hmm. and still make them laugh. Yeah. He be having people flying from uh, like London, Asia, come through to see him out here. And I'm like, what the fuck? That's hey, crazy. That's crazy. But hold on. Did we ever what what do Australian how do they like besides talking bad English? Like what is their language? Is that it? English. It's mm-hmm. yeah, it's just bad. Yeah, Why is it English though? Like like it's like, because they, the British was over there. They like colonized it. And now it's like oh. a, a version of British English. Because you yeah. notice it, it's like it's like a British accent, but like country, I guess. Country. Ooh, but, like, yeah. right? So yeah, it's, it's Louisiana it's like, and Mississippi. It's almost like white hood. It's like it, it's like white people's Baltimore. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> I thought it was, I thought it was like white people's Mississippi. White people's white people's Creole. Yeah, you know, right. Yeah. yeah, baby. Yeah. Exactly. You're here for two seconds, yeah. you're like, oh, Australia. Those are like the hood is white people too. Those are like the real like that's like they're like. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. They're like uh ghetto. I heard there's super jokes out there. You don't, you don't think what? Australians like white people's ghetto? That's like no. picking up snakes and shit. That's like, you that, know, they, they, who the corporate niggas identify they, with. They're like the Florida of uh white people. <laughs> the <world? laughs> uh, of the, the British seven. Seven. The That's the world seven like uh like loose pit dog pit bulls. That's what the kangaroos are there. Yeah. <laughs> So I'm a, I'm a, I ain't never think comedy was gonna take me to Australia, but fuck it, no. you know, I get kangaroos. Lit, and imagine bombing out there. You like you ever go a whole day without seeing kangaroos, and they're just like, no, I, no, I, no, I, no, I, no, I, I don't like no, I, I don't like no, I. Hey, no, is fucking hilarious. No, I, no, I, no, I. And look, and look. Be like Noi, Noi. Okay, uh, moving on. <laughs> Noi. Give it up for the ladies. <laughs> <laughs> Noi, get out. Okay. <laughs> oh, that's fucking hilarious. <laughs> well, shit. This is about as good a spot as, uh, as any for us to move on into this first topic of the day. We got the OG squad here. We got Med School, CP, Lulu, Pat, and I'm to hear more. We're gonna jump into this first topic right after this. It's everybody's favorite part of the podcast, the part that nobody ever skips, sponsored by Lucy Nicotine. Lucy's tobacco-free gum, pouches, and breakers are intelligent nicotine options for upstanding, responsible adults like yourself. All Lucy products have three things in common. No tobacco, powerful nicotine, and delicious flavors. Shipping is always free. And there's a 30-day refund policy if you change your mind. Lucy has sent me a couple products, and I've been really enjoying the gum. And it tastes like normal gum, if normal gum had a nicotine kick. I'm using the four milligram myself, and I love that mint flavor. Keeps my breath minty fresh. So visit lucy.co and use the promo code SQUAD, S-Q-U-A-D-D, to get 20% off your first order. That's lucy, L-U-C-Y, dot C-O, promo code SQUAD, to receive 20% off and always free shipping. And here comes the fine print. Lucy products are only 
for adults of legal age. And every order is age verified. Warning, this product contains nicotine. Nicotine is an addictive chemical. Would you rather receive a nude versus a random $20 cash app, nigga? $20 cash app. Twenty dollars. Why, why is this even a topic? I ain't even. I, I can't sell a nude. I got twenty dollars <laughs> richer. The, the nude can be a dude. You, you just said a nude. I'm, <laughs> that's a nice, I, that's no, a no, nice no. Well, obviously, no. the nude well, could be something you got off the internet and just sent somebody. It could be well, somebody. Well, the nude would be from somebody that you're attracted to. Oh, why well, you ain't say that? A wizard didn't say that. <laughs> Pornography. Hey, the though the fuck. Huh? I still want that twomp. Twomp? Twomp. $20. Twomp. $20. Now, twomp. Is that a thing before just now? You feel me? <laughs> hey, no. Hey, that's a hey, real nigga say twomp. Niggas in the hood know what a twomp is. I heard, yeah, yeah. I remember saying it back in the day. Back yeah, in the day. Back in the day. That's I tight. I never heard that. That must be Midwest. No no so that's the Midwest thing? My SD. Y'all, hey, but y'all can have it though. See, let, let a nigga hold a twomp. Yeah, let me grab that. <laughs> That's so funny. I'm gonna start using that. That is Hell so yeah. Yeah. A twomp. I, I like that's the favorite. My favorite thing about going to other cities is learning their lingo and taking yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> Cause it, cause it, when you remix wow. it with your shit, it's like, oh, I like that. That goes perfectly. <laughs> I've been needing a, a twenty dollar bill nickname. Got it. <laughs> you go back to your city and say it for the first time. You're like, let me get a twomp. Everyone's like, what is, <laughs> what is, what's like you got what, what you got Hey, <laughs> like a house party just break out because you said that. Everybody, oh, <laughs> oh shit, dude. Hey, we throw a party tonight. <laughs> lingo party. <laughs> New lingo party. <laughs> Wait, what was Harriet Tubman supposed to be on? A twomp? A she was supposed twomp? to be the twomp. She's supposed <laughs> to be the face twomp, of the twomp. Got, got you wouldn't, bad, you wouldn't call bad. it a tub? Damn, we might have to start doing that. But That's dope. A tub. Oh, let me get a tub. A tub, a tub is crazy. Yo, yeah. let me get a tub on it. But they yeah. pushed that shit back like a, a movie release. That shit is crazy. Yeah. I've never seen that before. That's the most racist shit ever. How does a dollar get pushed back? Yeah, that's crazy. That, that is money. crazy. Like, <laughs> nigga, get the graphic designer in there and print the shit out. Like, right. We already know what Harriet Tubman looked like. We don't even need a new design. They should have never said it. They should have never said it, bro. They could have right. put, uh, they could have, they could have, I mean, cause she looked mean, dog. That's, that's gonna be some mean money. They could have put, they could have put, <laughs> hey, Felicia don't do Rashad. that. They all look mean. They, they all put, look mean. They could have put Felicia Rashad on that bitch. That's, <laughs> what the hell? that's gonna oh, be what some baby mean steps, nigga, money. <laughs> Claire Huxtable, she don't deserve all of this shit. Hey, don't do that. Everybody else look mean. George Washington look mean as hell, and he's on a one dollar bill, so it's extra right. mean. It's extra judging. But he the most used. You know what I'm saying? Right. That's why he mad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he like in another bitch's ass crack. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. Hey, would you take a job to the strip club though? Or would you feel bad? <sighs> Oh, man. <laughs> you say what? Hey, he'd be like, please, take put a me on the floor. Put me on the floor. Nigga, stuff it in the bitch's drawer. Like, God damn it. I mean, I think that's what Harriet Tubman did all that shit for. To be a crack of asses? That's, that's, that's a, that's a new time. get paid. That's what I'm saying. That. She's she's the new face of money. She probably don't care where she's thrown. <laughs> <laughs> that's a big accomplishment. Wow. <laughs> Mean money, nigga. Man. That's funny. Hilarious. What was the topic? I'm sorry. Oh, uh, a nude don't look that mean. A, yeah, nude or twomp. <laughs> or a tub. Nude or a tub. I'm I'm still going Ooh. 20. I'm, yeah, I'm still going to get that 20. money. I don't give a fuck who owned the 20. I'm going 20. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, you picked it. Why you picked this oh, topic here? Are you choosing the nude? <laughs> <laughs> I said, why you pick this topic? Choosing you choosing the nude here? Yeah, rich nigga. You know, I don't give a fuck about a twenty dollar bill, nigga. Show me what you got. Put <laughs> <laughs> your titties on the line. <laughs> show me. A, hey, well, he, like, he like Steve mind, Harvey. Show me genitalia. In my mind, like if 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 I through the wizard's magic, if it's my celebrity crush that sent me the nude, that might mean like I got a chance, right? Like. 
No. Fuck with Megan Good. Fuck what Megan Good got going on right now. If Megan Good shoots me a nude, right? And she's like, hey, I love your work. Uh, hope we can grab a drink or something. We look forward to it. And then, by the way, boom, fire that off. I'm like, word? I'm Ain't sure no wizards it. work like that. <laughs> yeah, like, and what? that don't mean you got a chance. To the wizard, you surprise. think the wizard would send you your favorite person, celebrity crush, dude? Listen, <laughs> you think you think Michael B gonna be in my DMs like, hey, I think you funny as shit. By the way, first of all, you this. and Tahir and shooting your shot publicly on a fucking podcast is, is really <laughs> fucking sending me right now. But also, <laughs> to hear the things that you say behind the colored tint glasses you choose always helps <laughs> you up. Just behind the red tint, you like, you know, make it good decided to uh, <laughs> uh Delightfully the slap me like, like, like hey, yo. Hey, a nigga can dream. A I nigga can it. dream. Shit. <laughs> Every nigga you gonna get a nude dream. from Matthew Good. <laughs> <laughs> you gonna be oh, like this. <laughs> Give me the twomp. I need the twomp. <laughs> it ain't Megan, but <laughs> you'll be looking at good. us in the twenties. <laughs> <laughs> it ain't Megan, but it's good. Uh, I'm good. <laughs> that was my that was my thinking with it. If it came from like your celebrity crush or somebody like that, nigga, that might be a chance. That might be your door opening right there. What if what if somebody else sends you that nude? Like, what if your homeboy sends you a nude of Megan Good, so you don't even get that connection? Nah, nah, it don't work like that. It's coming from the person. <laughs> okay, so it's. Okay. That's it's coming from source. the person. It's not. It's not a scam. It's coming from that person. Wait, but Man, does that mean I need to see the new any way I can see it because that that is going to determine whether or not you still my crush or not. Like, bitch, I ain't got time to be. What's in the draws? Because I we need to know. But I need to know if it's a guaranteed link after. I don't want to just be switching nudes or seeing nudes. What am I going to do with that? I need to know: Are we linking or not? Nah? Yeah, that's oh, not no, what's the point of a news. I, I still yeah. be excited about news. I don't, I don't give a fuck what y'all talking about. Y'all niggas act like y'all so above news. And it's y'all a so lot of news, bro. I, you walk down them Twitter, Twitter streets. I'm still right here with the shit when I get a nude. I'm like, nigga. Like, what are you, a 13-year-old boy? The other Sexually option is repressed? money. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm right. down with a free nude, but damn. Yeah, but I'm going to spend that $20 on somebody's OnlyFans subscription anyway. Bro. So I either way, I'm going to do Lord. I'm getting a nude either way. Hey, here you are. Like, you put the way too dollars. much sex. Like, you could just Bro. put the twenty dollars into not, a new You lying? Fan. You're not about to spend that twenty dollars on somebody's OnlyFans. You gonna only well, fans you like six ninety nine? Hot dog OnlyFans. Yeah, he, he be buying multiple dog. subscriptions. Y'all don't know. He be got like four or five subscriptions. Out Look of at time. his glasses. Look at his oh. glasses. Those oh. them Tony Stark glasses. I'm supporting small businesses. You niggas don't care about the community. <laughs> Them glasses help him find other freckle people fast. And Meg, you set your prude ass up. You only have sex after a, a two-year hibernation. Don't nobody give a fuck about what you got going on. You fucking No, rude. my daughter is one, so clearly a year one ago. One year hibernation. <laughs> one year hibernation. <laughs> Actually. <laughs> well, actually, you gotta yeah, put that in my so Meg is like chocolate dip prunes and coloring books. Ain't nobody trying to fuck. Yes, they yeah, are to that. That might, that might be chocolate fun. covered prunes. That might be fun. That. Is that what you're you you like a porn <laughs> director right now. <laughs> you, you like you direct porn right now. Like spread that ass out. Spread that ass out. There you go. Yeah, spread that ass out. Yeah, and put the top piece of bread on. Script? You think they come and in the right? top piece okay. of lettuce? These are the beats. Reach on we both sides. Want... Yeah, <laughs> it's a whole script. <laughs> that's why I watch amateur porn. I don't need all of that stage direction and blocking and all that shit. I Bro, like the stories, the man. I like the stories, man. The stories. The stories like is what's packing me up. Like, well, I can't take it fucking the Easter Bunny and her parents don't even see it because they're taking the picture and the Easter Bunny back there fucking her and y'all don't even, what? This hey, that's more crazy. of a situation, though. The stories was like the scripted intros and, yeah, okay. and, and like stuff like that. The situation, like those do be show. crazy. Those ones, it's always in the same house with wood finish. 
<laughs> and it's always ridiculous, like Thanksgiving dinner, yeah, but you know, someone's yeah, getting head under the table. Right, oh, so the, niggas the know, huh? Be doing too niggas much. Know. I don't, don't want to hear mm-hmm. your playlist. I don't want. I don't know what you streaming on Spotify. They be having a Twitter name at the bottom. I know. Like, I'm not gonna hey. check you out after I come. I like, right. I like oh, the ones who play their music. I hate that. You could oh. tell. You could tell by the 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 look of the DVD if they have their own music on. There's it. the one who yeah. put, like before he even lets you get to the dick, he puts his play his song he's playing, and he's mm-hmm. like, "Follow me on Spotify," and then he start going ham. That's, That's crazy. not the time. You know about that, huh? Y'all niggas was just talking shit about me having a subscription, but you know about those details right there, you little That's free, Because the that, song that's was bumping for a minute, and then before it was over, then he started fucking. I was like, oh, shit, I got distracted. Was- Damn, he played it way before they started fucking? That's crazy. <laughs> and he's like, you know, listen to my music before you get this dick. Like- <laughs> Damn. I respect it. <laughs> get it out any way you can, my boy. <laughs> I remember when Mr. Marcus was doing uh, DVDs and it was just like, it would, it would be like three back to back different storylines and they all had mixtapes in it. And it was, it was, it was rough, rough on the Good old days, man. Uh, Paul they went through a dark how much time we had to beat off. Like they got, they got five minutes to beat up, get to the point. <laughs> like Those were like 30 minutes. 2008 and 2011, it was a shaky time for porn because they were thinking about what? making the, making condoms mandatory in porn. Then you had um, what what's are you, the, the historian? Porn the porn yeah, story? The year the accuracy story? is wild. Listen, listen, <laughs> why are you a shareholder? What's the, what's the what's the dude name that used they had supposedly signed a G unit? He used to be at the North Hollywood. Uh, Brian, oh, Pumper. He used to stalk Brian Pumper. Brian Pumper. Brian Pumper. He used to stalk. <laughs> He was yo, cracking eggs on bitches' head. That was his I remember thing. that. That was legendary. Yo, he followed me out to my car after the gym, right? And uh, I thought I lost him. And then two seconds later, he was knocking on my window. And I was like, hey, man, what you want? How did you lose Brian Pumper? <laughs> you got That's the move. biggest like, nigga. <laughs> right. <laughs> so I my that nigga had this song called, I Get the Pussy. <laughs> <laughs> yo, he, yo, I got to my car and he knocked on the window, right? So I was like, yo, I locked the door. I was like, yo, what you want, man? And then he was like, I was like, damn. Man. So I rolled down the window like just this much. And he was like, I got something for you. And he had like four DVDs and a manila envelope. <laughs> and he gave it to me. And then he was like, it's for you. I was thinking about you for you. And it was his DVD. It was like porn. Wait, his I'm porn? Like, yo. Wow. I lie, though. That's a dog ass calling car. If I had porn of myself it, that day, it'd be like, yeah, here's, you know, if you, yeah, here, here's my porn, take me out. If you would like to fuck <laughs> like that, you let me know. <laughs> <laughs> if you would like to fuck like this, you let me know. There is a menu on there. Just reference the DVD and the numbers, oh, and then crazy. I can get right to you. Nigga, he is no different than AB to me. That put that shit on, A B. Put that shit on, A B. That's 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 this. That's a, hey, but this is way easier to do than that pumper dance. I yeah, could I, I wouldn't different. be able to accurately do this if you gave me a week. Wait, that's his <laughs> dance, dude. Man, he did like he did like a character off Def Jam Vendetta right now. He's right. Right. You look like a character on Fall Guys. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, that God shit is man. like drunk and it fighting. Looked, it looked like when your character gets stuck in a glitch. Like, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> what the fuck? It's the most Damn. ridiculous dance, but his shit kind of go, but only he could do it. Like nobody else could oh master his God. dance, though. Right. Everybody that's else. That's the most ridiculous it. shit. Damn. So we all going $20 or what? <laughs> that's that something. No, those uh, those poor dudes are creepy. What's his name? Mr. Mark. I had an encounter with Mr. Marcus, and it, I did not know who he was. Not like that. Not a sexual encounter. I was at a nobody thought that. Week? Week? I didn't oh, think that. Okay, yeah, okay. <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm thinking like y'all was in an elevator or something. Thank nobody you. thought that. Oh, oh, wow. I appreciate it. It must have been that Ralph. Ralph or something. Nobody ever thinks your asexual ass. Okay, thank you. Thank you, thank you so uh, much, guys. Trust me, I was thank not you. fucking up. We were not blurred out. Don't worry. We weren't blurred out. Nobody thought that ever. Okay, thank you. Oh, that makes me feel so much better. No, I was at the, so when I first moved to LA, I was, my homegirl was like, hey, there's a party at the Roosevelt, like, hotel, like, you know, at the bottom level. She was like, 
um, <clears throat> come through. So I went over there and it was like real dark. I don't know what was going on. Clearly I'm green. I don't know nothing about this, but there was like you the way it was you that, green when she invited, just go ahead. <laughs> there was like, there's couches and like, there's like, it looks like there was like a bed and it, I don't know what it was. I don't know what event had happened there, but when I got there, it was like just a lounge, but it had all that stuff there. So next thing you know, um, she, I, I meet up with her. She goes to talk to somebody. So I'm just standing there and this guy comes up to me and he's like, Hey, what's up? And he like shakes my hand, but he does, you know what I'm talking about Lulu when men shake your hand and be a little too long, little too, and you'd be like, okay, thank you. He did one of those. And I was like, oh, hey, nice to meet you. I was like, my name is Megan. He's like, yeah. And so I was like, you don't introduce, like, what's your name? I don't know you. Like, you don't go say your name. He was like, oh, you don't know who I am. And I was like, like, should I? Like, is this your party or something? I don't, I don't know. What's your name? He was like, my name is Marcus. And I was like, oh, okay. Well, nice to meet you, Marcus. Like, whatever. <laughs> and then so I'm sitting there talking to him. <laughs> and my homegirl, who, like, who was talking to somebody else, looks and sees me. She was like, like her, like come on, and I was like, well, I gotta go. My friends over there, so I walk over there. And I was like, what's wrong? She was like, why are you talking to him? And I was like, what do you mean? Like he just came over, and introduced himself. She's like, do you know who that is? I was like, yeah, his name's Marcus. And she was like, Mr. Marcus. And I was like, okay. And she was like, you clearly don't watch porn, do you? And I was like, no. And she was like, it's Mr. Marcus, the porn star. And I was like, oh, okay. Clarifying yeah. Mr. Marcus, if you didn't know who that was, it's hilarious. Like, you, right. that's Mr. So, Marcus. Okay. And, and Mr. was supposed to make you be like, oh, oh. Right. <laughs> oh, that's Mr. Mr. <laughs> Do you know who that is? That's not Marcus. That's Mr. Marcus. And I was like, so I had, is that I a professor? <laughs> <laughs> hey, was he in Tim's? Hey, what if he was naked remember. with only Tim's while he was talking to Meg? <laughs> Man, <laughs> lucky. On brand Context <laughs> clues. I would have figured something That's out. my dream. <laughs> That's What's your dream? Naked I with do with Tim's a do-rag, actually. At a party <laughs> that everyone else is dressed at. <laughs> That's wild. <laughs> <laughs> and he just like, I get the pussy. <laughs> <laughs> Lewis, like, my dreams do come true. <laughs> that guy. Which one? The, the naked nigga with the tips. The naked nigga with the tips. <laughs> what y'all going with, man? Sorry about the with? long hand hold. We got that from 90 sitcoms. When that's uh, like, no, it's creepy. Like, creep the hand. No, yeah. people yeah. don't know he's creepy. Yeah. Well, and everybody's sometimes, sometimes it works. Sometimes it works, you know. If, <laughs> I'm sure that worked four times that night on other women. He was out here just being, you know who I am. And I feel like if the woman steps back and you're still holding her hand, you should let it go. <laughs> what is she going to let if her, if her body moves backwards, let go of the hand. Then yeah. let's just. I agree. I agree. Yeah. Then it start getting like, like freak nigga. Like, hey, 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 girl. Hey, bitch. Hey. <laughs> no, thank you. No, thank you. <laughs> and those dude's hands with the, uh, is the always mad, clammy. What are we doing? Who do $20? Why don't we ask us? We already know everybody doing twank. $20. The twank. What was it? The twank. The twank. <laughs> Damn it. The twank right, and the twank. Call it a twank. The twank. But the twomps have it on that one. We're going to jump into this next topic uh, right after get this. To write it down. This episode is sponsored by Blue Chew. Let's talk about sex, fellas. Remember the days when you were always ready to go? Mm -hmm. Now you can increase your performance and get that extra confidence in the bedroom. Listen up. BlueChew.com, all right? BlueChew is a unique online service that delivers the same active ingredients as Viagra, Cialis, and Levitra. But they do it in chewable tablets and at the fraction of the cost. Plus, you can take them anytime, day or night, so you can plan ahead or be ready whenever the opportunity arises. The process is so simple. Sign up at BlueChew.com, consult with one of their licensed medical providers, and once you're approved, you receive your prescription within days. And here's the best part. It's all done online, so no visits to the doctor's office, no awkward conversations, and no waiting in line at the pharmacy. Blue Chew's tablets are made in the USA and prepared and shipped direct to your door in a discreet package. Look, they always say first impressions are important. What about lasting impressions? Blue Chew wants to help you have a better sex drive. Discover your options at BlueChew.com. 
chew it and do it. And we got a special deal for our listeners. All right, try Blue Chew free when you use the promo code Squad at checkout. All right, just pay five dollars for shipping. That's BlueChew.com promo code Squad S Q U A D D to receive your first month free. Visit BlueChew.com for more details and important safety information. And we thank Blue Chew for sponsoring this podcast. This one is a doozy. Second topic of the day. We have miseducation of Lauren Hill versus confessions by Usher. Confessions. What? Not Lauren close. Hill. Not close. Confessions. One of them but here's the thing. Now here's here, here's the rub. Whichever one you pick, the other one disappears and never ever existed. That's mm. fine. That's fine. <laughs> <laughs> it's still that easy for you niggas it was a yeah. great album but it didn't do the same stuff you know what you talking about what wait, wait, how what dare album? you patrick wait, how wait, dare wait. you disown your your soul sister okay you don't do that to other black women you are a proud black woman yourself don't ever do that <laughs> oh that's what you meant by other hmm? <laughs> <laughs> what album were you talking about pat I think the confessions did more for me and Usher. Like, if he didn't have confessions, he might not. He, that was a good, uh, you know, bridge to the rest of his career. Lauren kind of dropped that and dipped. So, but she's still touring off that one album, and she'd she be late to every to show. <laughs> hey, I went to Usher's residency. He start on time, and he is a ball of fun. Yes, it was great. I will go like again. on time when you say it's seven o'clock on a dot. If you, if it's not seven, then it kind of loses. It's, <laughs> it's, it's not at seven. You gotta be a punctual nigga to do that. That's if you pull that off correctly, you know what I'm saying? You gotta get there at six fifty eight. Be like, you ready? All right, cool. Hit it. You know what I'm saying? Like, I mean, shit started happening at seven. He came on like seven fifteen, but shit started happening. The show started yeah. at seven. Yeah. Yeah. It was a good ass show too. Not on the good ass show. Is that it over? was a classic album though. Uh, almost it's over every song in that album hit on Usher's Confessions. Almost every, and that's hard because you remember back in the day when people was putting out albums. If you could, if you had an album that had like four bangers on it, you was winning. Your album was amazing, and he has way more than that on this album. What are the, what are the bangers? Because because uh, I feel like Lauren Hill's shit <laughs> yeah, yeah, is a little yeah. bit more classic. But what are the bangers on the Confessions? That's what it's made for. He had a Superstar. bunch of them. Confessions one, Confessions two, Part Superstar. Two. Uh, what is it? Bad girl. You got a bad. No. Ooh, I need a bad, bad girl. Yeah, bad girl's on here. Get at bad me, bad girl. girl. You don't have to call. You don't have to. Was that on that? Nah, that, that ain't on, on that one. That's that on there. On that. That's not on that. It's on there. I'm trying Ooh. to pull up the track list. Caught up. It's, I think caught up is on there. So hey, hey, yeah, caught up is on there. Superstar. Uh, what you it? Uh, what is it? Follow me. Come follow me. Oh, hey, it's art. crazy to be the one who cheated and then you make classic art. <laughs> it's usually the opposite. Like, it's usually like, damn, I'm gonna make this album because I got cheated on. He had a baby on a girl and then he blew up. JB <laughs> and then, and then put it, made an interlude about it and everything. Like, put that on everything. It's like his put best work. Everything. It's insane. <laughs> put that on everything. <laughs> Talk about turning put nothing into something. That was an iconic album. Man, it that was. is a great album. This is making it harder now that I'm looking at what's in it. Yeah, see? Yeah. Uh, easy, all of y'all. Easy. It's, it's not easy. Lawrence's album is a classic. But it for is. It is. Person, nothing even matters to Zion. But for me, I listen to Usher is like everything. every day. I listen to, I don't, I listen to Lauren once in the blue. I listen to that Usher thing. literally every day. Does she empower y'all? Can't take, I don't know, does she empower you? <laughs> ah, that's a funny ass question. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a great album. I just it love it. It is a great it. album. It is a great album. Did she empower y'all? Was... Were y'all empowered? <laughs> <laughs> Did she have any power after you were in power? (laughs) (laughs) Did she empower you like a spider bite from a radioactive spider? (laughs) That's uh I feel like she's just I feel like she's more versatile because she sings and raps, but I don't know. I should be rapping too. Uh, They call me her old teacher. She was singing and it'd be like Oh, no, oh, oh, hey. oh, with me. Got a nigga finger out Joe to see every time that you Okay, and what else? Diddy uh, wrote that. They were <laughs> what else? <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
I don't know. It's so hard. I'm hey, are niggas really still go. spelling their names like that? Hell no. Nah. Is that done? <laughs> Him, the nigga from Atlanta, A-T-L-A, and he was one of the coldest spelling niggas. I-N-D-E-P. You know what I'm saying? The South was best at spelling their name. They could make a whole verse. Yeah. Fabulous. Fabulous became so known for it. That was kind of like his uh, Metro Boot, his tag. Like that F-A-B-O-L-O. I'm going to tell you what's the it was to hear. Remember that song he did with that girl? So went to you, super, super woman. And then when he faded out his verse, it was like, yeah, oh, hey, yeah. Yo. And it was just like, like then he didn't even finish it. We just knew what it was. Mm-hmm. Hard. Hey. Shut up, shut up, hey, remember when niggas ran out of bars in the third verse and they just started uh, naming cities? <laughs> 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 yeah. That was huge. They'd be like, uh, <laughs> Miami, hey, Los Angeles. <laughs> hey, at least Uncle Luke was like, where the Leo's at? Like, nigga, <laughs> astrology. <laughs> nigga went to astrology. <laughs> Capricorn, Capricorn. <laughs> Bitch was like, yeah! <laughs> Capricorn, Capricorn. He, he was a genius. Oh, the time, no, no. Everybody in the time. Yeah. Um, no, I like when they started putting uh, people on blast. Like, you got a hundred dollar bill, put your hands up. You got a fifty dollar bill, put your hands up. Rude. Those are rough times. Rough hey. <laughs> that man's scoop was kind of rude. Man. <laughs> I, don't, I was really out of high school. I'm said. like, nigga, calm down, bro. <laughs> Somebody should have came out with a remix. Nigga. Like, you got low body fat, put your hands up. Oh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> what, like a, a exercise tape? <laughs> no, like this the fat man school. Just like come back at him, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> that man scoop is pretty funny. That's what was he scooping? <laughs> Ice cream. <laughs> Ice cream. <laughs> Can you imagine his doctor like scoop? Listen, <laughs> you were a handful two months ago. <laughs> <laughs> your first name, fat out man. Your last name, scoop. This <laughs> has to stop. <laughs> Whatever you are I not say, your name. Do. You don't have to identify. <laughs> <laughs> and are we still scooping? We we are still scooping. Okay, so that's not that's not changed. His wife like he's still scooping. <laughs> he's still in the room. <laughs> he's still scooping. <laughs> he's, I keep telling him to stop scooping, but he can't. Can I have stop. a word with you for a second? They, <laughs> they, they go outside. Last night I caught him scooping. <laughs> Double scoops. <laughs> bitch <you> learn. <laughs> bitch learn. I, I would never double scoop. <laughs> bitch lying. How did this turn Man. into a whole scenario? <laughs> scoop, look at me. Look at me. It was a double scoop, wasn't it? <laughs> Since that man scoops intervention. <laughs> hey, Man, oh, you uh, ever uh, seen six hundred pound yeah. life? That's that nigga changed his life. That nigga, hey, hold on. That, that nigga do a little speech today. My name is just Fat Man, no longer Scoop. <laughs> <laughs> fat Man, thank you. Oh, man. Like... Nah, he gotta have, he gotta drop the fat too. He just gotta be a man, you know. Oh man, it, man, it's Scoop ain't got a time. <laughs> they find ice cream balls in his locker. Yeah. What the hell is this? <laughs> I'm sorry. You know the scoop was anonymous? <laughs> <laughs> he started telling this story. I wasn't even eating the cones, Jack. <laughs> it was just piles of cones in my room. I didn't need the cones. I just wanted the scoop. I just needed the scoop, Jack. <laughs> That's how fucked up I was. I just needed to school. Oh my gosh. <sighs> my uh, face hurts. Oh, <laughs> uh, that nigga just needed to school. Uh, <laughs> Summer's Dis- wrong with y'all. Discarding the cones is wild business. Right. Do y'all eat your ice cream with cones or you just eat it like two scoops? I, I like cone. it with cones, but it sometimes depends. I don't have the patience to hold that bitch and eat it fast enough for it not to get crazy. So I'm too old for cones. The cup That's is why you less only gotta get one scoop. You can't do two scoops. That's, That's too much. You can't. You gotta race against the clock with two scoops. And they melt together, and and you gotta like pair them a little bit. Yeah. All right, man. Listen, all of that. my line. CP, what up? It's Scoop. I got your number from uh, <laughs> who? Nigga, Scoop. 
You know what time it is, nigga. It's school. That is funny. Hey, man, what y'all going with, bro? Put it to a vote. I don't even want to be here with y'all no more, man. This education, <laughs> this education or confession. I'm getting off of here, nigga. Which one got to go or which one got to stay? Which one are you picking? Confessions. Hey, now, you damn. know that the miseducation leaves forever. It never existed. So then, so then I never knew about damn. it. Fuck it. I never knew about it. You a cold. No, you know about it. Head. You just can never hear those songs again. No, that ain't what he said. He said it never existed. How will I know yeah. about it? Oh. it? Never existed. Never existed, man. Dang, that's... it's no wrong answer here. It really is. But oh, you know, it, only I thing is, she can't dance. <laughs> <laughs> He's right. I, I, I ain't going to hold you. I ain't going to hold you. I'm a big Lauryn Hill fan. Her concert can't top Usher's. No. no that shit ain't right. It can't top This nigga be skating. Uh, Come bro, on, man. So He's fun, skating. Bro. The he had, he had so skaters. Fun. He had strippers. He Yo, had. When the stage mm -hmm. transformed, Lou. When the stage transformed and Yo. that shit came down. <laughs> Meanwhile, Lauren Hill slapping an acoustic. <laughs> yeah, and crying. Aww, and, me Usher. and crying. Yeah, yeah, yeah I guess late as fuck. Hey, yo. Yo. But, I, mean, I can't compare it. <laughs> Two hours late. Dude, this is like everything is my delivery. It's my delivery. <laughs> I, I propose to my wife off of Nothing Even Matters, right? I smash, oh. I smash way more than can you handle it. We way more smash than can you handle it. Listen, I guarantee you that Farron would say yes, no matter who was playing in the background. Okay? <laughs> That's she, true. It, but the smashes she remembering them times she, yeah, she smashed. She remember, it was on the playlist. I made her a CD. Yes. <laughs> Did you put Laura Hill on the CD? No, it was all exactly. Under, no, still meet it in my bedroom. You don't smash the Lauren Hill. You make candles to Lauren Hill. You, <laughs> you recite, you, you recite nuptials to Lauren Hill, nigga. Tie like, sage oh. together. You separate <laughs> the macadamias from the cashews. <laughs> Right, I'm going Usher too, bro. I'm going Usher. Usher. Uh, okay, I'll go Usher too. But oh, nothing Usher. even matters. That's my song. But that song never matters. Don't matter, matter if it over. never existed. Nothing I know, ever matters. I know. Y'all some cold niggas, bro. Nothing never matters. <laughs> Lauren Hill is is rug choosing music. <laughs> These are all versions. Wow. Out of here, bro. Pat, everything you are, you are, are, is today, are these 10 feet? Okay. Anytime Pat is sick, <laughs> anytime Pat is sick, this nigga just mean for no reason, bro. Right. I didn't nigga, even know the nigga was sick. You man, sick? He coughing into his fucking sleeve like an 80 year old lady. Hey, I hugged you like eight times yesterday. I didn't know you were sick. I'm not Ooh. sick, sick. I'm okay, just under the wet. cold. We're skinny dipping with some niggas. I know. <laughs> Don't so come right back to the last topic. No, why you slide that in like that? No. Right. right <laughs> that. <laughs> well, that's the lead to a cold. This <laughs> oh, right. Hey, hey, it's here. This nigga Pat called a nigga next day. You feeling a little sniffly? I'm feeling a little sniffly, but I don't know if it was that water. He's like, did your hair get wet? Oh, <laughs> man. Why you say he was skinny dipping with his stomach? I think that. I put his towel on. He wrapped it around his chest. His whole bro, ass this is not want a towel. Is this is the most evil podcast, bro. <laughs> like it, it's like it's so <laughs> evil, dog. Man, I swear to God, bro. I, I be looking at my loop or sometimes, like, what the fuck is going on? Bigger <laughs> packing out the shower. <laughs> I be like, hair what the wrapped fuck? up, towel on his chest. Oh boy, I was like, so uh, what you finna do? <sighs> Hey, let me tell you, CP, that is probably the best thing I ever came up with in my life, and I'm so happy that it haunts you to this day. Uh, <laughs> I got a three pack of lupus, bro. I was just walking through CVS like, man, I'm better than this, dog. <laughs> 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 I'm better than this, getting these little tri-color packs. I'm better than this shit. All right, let me try to find the ones that look a little masculine. I'm seeing this. Last topic of the day, we have, would you rather... Have a transformer versus have hey. a Power Ranger Zord. Huh? Wait, wait. So that if I have a Power Ranger Zord, that means I'm a Power Ranger. 
What is a Zord? Somewhat, I guess. No. I mean, well, a Zord I mean, from since I was 10. What is it again? It's you can drive a better like an not an animal. Animal. It's like the, the tricer triceratops, the, the saber tooth tiger. Oh, 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 okay. Wait, but are we talking about the individual or the one exactly. that they all oh, you don't have the, the Megazord. Megazord. You have you one have Zord. Megazord. Yeah, oh, but when we all come together, the Megazord. That's fine. Listen, Lulu. Really? Power Raiders was on the air in like 1995. These are used Zords that you didn't got <laughs> off of a lot somewhere. No, these are new. This is new. Zord. These are new. No, Zord. these are new. The was forty thousand dollars. You have that. That shit. This shit got real started. Why did uh, anybody want to? It got two hundred thousand miles. Ready for this? A transformer could turn into a regular car and fit in your garage. Boom. Yeah, that's wait, wait, wait. But if it transforms while you drive it in your garage, it'll spit you out if it transforms while you're driving it. And it's your friends. They're not gonna really fuck with it's not gonna hurt you. It won't like oh, mangle you. Not, no, remember it'll like spit you out before it like transform. You know, what about you know? Zord? talk to you. Your Zords don't talk to you. Your Zord, Zord don't, don't do shit. You. And you gotta drive that bitch. And it, <laughs> bro, like what? And there's no way to put it. Like he said, there's no way the pterodactyl was going to a fucking active volcano. In 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 Angel Grove, oh, yeah. I don't even know where an active volcano Big is. Where is the Angel Grove? Yeah, Angel 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 to call it with a flute. That shit would take fourteen hours to get to you because that shit surfaced in the middle of Africa, and now you <laughs> dead as hell. <laughs> but the thing, if if I have a transformer, I'm just the bitch driving the transformer. If I got a Zord, I am a ranger. No, you're you not can drive a Batmobile. Man. That don't make you Batman. You're not in high school. Like, no. To be a to be a 30-something ranger, you don't want to be a 30-something year old. Power you gotta be in high school. Man, my back do hurt. You can't like, like, what? It's another crime? God damn, I ain't got no gas money for this Zord. These people be broke. That's true. Like, Zordon did recruit high schoolers with no martial arts training. That is hilarious. <laughs> you know, Rocky had martial arts training in Zach. Oh, and they were Bobby. teachers, huh? Yeah. yeah. They were like... It wasn't, you know, you know, <laughs> it was like white belt moves. <laughs> but it was a belt. It was, it was hip hop karate. Zach was dancing, bro. Zach was dancing. <laughs> that's got to be yellow belt. <laughs> that's fine. That's no, fine. You, you you you're right. Y'all right. Y'all right. That's like theater department at the school karate. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, that's not real karate, bro. Wait, question. But, Does the Transformer always turn back into the same car? Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Yeah. So it can't be like an SUV one day and the next day it's a Lambo. Nah, you no, you gotta pick the you gotta pick which one you want to hilarious. Be. Your transformer was just turning into new cars. <laughs> wait, wait, what would y'all if you pick transformer, what would be y'all two vehicles? If I lived in LA, it would be um a fiat, it would be the first one. Ain't no way. Meg. A Fiat? You a know, Fiat? The shoulders Fiat. you got, man. Why would you even pick a car that that the passenger is not going to be comfortable at all? Even the wizard economy, would be like, "Come on, that's wow. going to be an economy row on a plane for you if you if you if you get a Fiat. You need. I get a Fiat every time I come to LA. Every you month. get you get any car you want though. <laughs> You just that <laughs> no, but if I live in LA, what is the practicality of having any car I want? It don't fit nowhere, and the gas is too expensive. It, it can transport on niggas. I'm getting a helicopter. My shit turning into a helicopter. That's what my transformer is gonna be. See, see, transformer. Now, see, I let this nigga hit, open his brain to say helicopter. See, uh, oh, well, I didn't know it could be. Uh, I thought it I was gonna be say like helicopter an automobile. Anything. I was uh -oh. already gonna say helicopter. That, I thought you was gonna say uh, uh, an automobile. A Fiat. <laughs> I would I would want like a Lambo or a Ferrari or something sweet. I want a Lambo. A Prius, a Prius. I'm getting a Prius. You say stuff just to upset us. Yeah. <laughs> First of all, it is expensive and I don't understand why y'all don't get this. It's logic. a transformer. This isn't an you're not buying an economy car. But you, you can, it uh, gotta uh, go places. It gotta be. But it adventure. gotta transform and protect you. Think about the personality of a Prius. <laughs> That's why, she she a That's why she picked it, lame it's, it's gonna transform into a meter maid. It's gonna transform and be like tickets, tickets. You be like, get him, get him, friends. I got him, friends. I got him. Citation, tickets, tickets. 
you gonna get your ass kicked? Wait, hold on. Nobody said this. Do Transformers need gas? No. no. They run off their soul. <laughs> That's a good question, though. I don't know. That's Plus, would they be violated like if they, you stuck the thing? They run off the spark. What's they never, they called? never, you Party never see them Party. gassing up at the end of the movies. No, we're not going up. We're going to say no. Let oh, me they was time. like, we ain't got time to show that in this action pack movie. We're going to cut out the gas station stop. Can you imagine Shia LaBeouf with a, the thing out and Optimus Prime got a bend over? <laughs> <laughs> you take a uh, unlimited or premium. <laughs> 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 Oh, uh, and, and, and I was proud of, oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, damn, I was just stopping for some water. <laughs> oh, shit, I know you're going to fill it up. Damn, okay. Fuck him, it's probably biting his lip and shit. <laughs> <laughs> Transformers. <laughs> uh, that would be so funny if I had a car that transformed to a Prius. Uh, for a fiat. Uh, oh, man. Man, just be saying anything to get us upset. Stop talking. Why? I was, I look, I thought I was trying to be socially responsible. Uh, Gas man, is expensive man. in LA. Uh, okay. I'm just proud to buy this. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's fucking uh, crazy. Because if you had a Prius, the robot would be ugly off top. There's no way it would transform into like a cool looking robot. Absolutely mm -mm. not. Mm mm. Whatever the new Priuses gonna, are not ugly. Look, it's gonna transform into one of those food delivery robots that be driving <laughs> down the sidewalk. <laughs> the little bucket. Them little parking lots. Wait, lot. one? Which one is a truck? Optimus. Optimus Prime. Optimus Prime. But he's like, like a semi truck, right? Yeah, yeah, I don't know why that they, they chose what I'm that. But... A semi truck. Why can't I be a Prius? Why can't I have a Prius then? You, you got whatever you like, man. <laughs> yeah. So key, a, a decent point because the semi truck was a weird choice for the main right. character. He could have he could have chose like a Ford F four fifty. No, because in that case. Optimus Prime used to pull all the other trucks. That's why he was like one of those big trailer trucks. Like, Wait, really? That's yeah. how they have it in the toys. <laughs> Damn, that makes sense. He carries the whole team literally. Mm -hmm. He's the leader. <laughs> they all were driving. Most of them were truck. I mean, cars anyway. Yeah, but when they get fucked up in battle, he take care of them. Nah, but his, his weapon was in the uh the trailer. The trailer came off of him. Like the trailer was just an addition. It wasn't actually a I part. I mean, it's like a purse, man. He took it off. Well, what should, what, what vehicle are y'all? Y'all didn't answer the thing. What are y'all choosing? For saving the fucking world. What don't we understand about that? It was a, it's a semi. That's a big ass truck. And it, can it doesn't do go it. fast though. He does go he fast and go he fast. rams through That's things. what I'm saying. So why my Prius can't go fast? Your Prius can't go past 55 what can miles it do? an hour. It, it can't even get out the way. <laughs> it can't. If, if he, yo, a Prius is way more agile than a semi truck. Okay. It, it yeah, always but will in be. battle, if you ain't charged up the night before, you're fucked. Like, <laughs> but what? But that's what Damn. I'm saying. We don't know fuel sources for any of these things. Why y'all arguing with her? Why y'all even giving her fucking energy? Hey, man, let's just put it to a vote, bro. Meg is just here for chaos. She don't even yes, care. Yeah. I she does don't not care. She just she is I literally, here for the go. Literally the every month off, when I the moment she gets off this broadcast, she got to go back to to parenting. So she just want to keep it going <laughs> for as long as she can. I'm serious though. Every time I come to LA, I always rent either a Fiat or a Prius. But if you could have if you could rent any car that you wanted besides a Prius, she can Lulu. That's what she does. <laughs> He's right. I can. She get does have whatever. the option. Like, bro, they She's always the have company the car like, down. Yes, Meg, we have those. We do have those for sure. I could get anything, and I choose to get those because they. It's L.A. I don't know why y'all don't get this. <laughs> that shit would tra anywhere, transform into anywhere. a calculator. <laughs> <laughs> no robot. <laughs> eat or eat. <laughs> so eat, eat. <laughs> All right, what y'all going with? Transformer. Transformer. Sure. Transformer. Transformer. Does anybody want no okay. damn used Zord off of Amazon? <laughs> <laughs> you ain't got nothing to fight either. <laughs> Use Black Frog Zord. <laughs> where do you even where do you even going with that? 
Hey, without the Megazord, you would be an awkward. Tra- they transform into like a left leg. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Quick, so what about the one that transforms into an arm? Like you can't do shit without no arm. Just in there, like none of that. <laughs> Where none everybody of at? <laughs> and you're thirty something, so now you're pissed off that everybody's late. So now y'all are arguing. <laughs> Magnum brought the baby in the door. I don't want to hear that. (laughs) Right. They do got to drive together. Yeah. It's a big ass carpool. (laughs) No, Meg got all the kids in her door, so we can't complete the mission. It's too loud in the back. No, we can't. I'd be like, I put it on mute. I'm sorry, guys. I was talking, but y'all couldn't hear me because my kids in the background crying. So it was on mute. Hey, what about the all the fights that the Megazord lost and they had a conversation afterwards? Like, nigga, you were supposed to duck. <laughs> <laughs> you were supposed to block that sweep. Uh, he's right. Everybody <laughs> is responsible for, for they one little piece. You they know what I'm saying? Piece. Like, why did so you kick? you in the leg and them niggas <laughs> never kick. I said, y'all should have kicked. <laughs> You got tripped. <laughs> you had one job, bro. You were oh. supposed to punch him while the open hand slap. Like, yeah. <laughs> and as simple as walking. Wait, I was supposed to go forward. You, me, then you, not us at the same time. You were supposed to block. Oh, man, I was texting. I'm sorry. I, 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 I didn't realize. You were that. That's way too much coordination. <laughs> All right, man. Well, listen. Thank y'all so much for another episode of Squadcast versus man. Shout out to the OG Squad, Man Scoop, CP, Patrick Cloud, Lulu Gonzalez. Of course, I'm to hear more. We'll see you next week on a brand new episode. What? <laughs> <laughs> the Australian <laughs> callback and a brand new episode. No way. No way. No way. Oh my god. Oh my god. How do I get out of this? Uh, you sound like you had your grill in. You see all the brand new episode. <laughs> hey, I didn't know how to get out of that shit. All I could do was just stop. I was like, fuck, I bet they heard that. <laughs> We all heard that. Oh, hey, I, I, I thought somebody would have signed off early. Up. I was like, maybe they signed off early. They didn't hear it. <laughs> nah, hey, Kenny, maybe they signed off early. You see us. Okay. Oh. <laughs> to the next episode. Hey. <laughs> yeah, the next episode. Bye. <laughs>